Maybe that's because getting to the bottom of possible problems with our digestive system can be seen as quite an intrusive business. And traditionally, that would involve using one of these. Thankfully for me, technology has made things an awful lot smaller. Hi there, I'm Christian. Hello. Dr. Christian has volunteered to have his entire digestive system investigated using a small piece of technology that has changed the way we look at our bodies. This tiny camera, no bigger than a large pill, is about to embark on a fantastic voyage inside Dr. Christian's body. Wash it right down into the stomach. So can I have a look at what's going on yes, inside yes, me yes, right now? Certainly you can. And this is real-time images. Yes. Golly, ooh. So right, I had breakfast this morning. That, I suspect, is going to make a difference to your images, is it? Oh, yes, indeed. Um, normally, when we're doing this, we would make sure that the person had had an overnight fast uh, with nothing to eat in the morning at all. So you'd see a nice empty stomach? So we'd stomach. see an empty stomach. The camera will keep taking pictures of the inside of Dr. Christian's body for the next seven hours and transmitting them to the recorder before eventually popping out the other end and disappearing for good down the toilet bowl. But the images are stored on the recorder and quickly available for diagnosis. So Roy, you've managed to get hold of all my images. Could you see anything? I didn't see anything abnormal. Um, That's a relief. So that I'm going to get that bit out of the way yeah, straight yes. away. Can you take me on a whistle-stop tour of my gut then? Yes, let, to, if we go right so back. Let's see the highlights. And these are the, the last images of the stomach. And in this image, you can actually see the opening from the stomach into the duodenum. So this is the valve that controls food leaving the stomach going on into the small intestine. Yeah. Yes, yes. Down around the duodenal loop. And from now on, we get really very good images of, of the small intestine. Along the edges of the folds, you can see finger-like villi. So it's these fingers yeah, yeah. that increase the surface area exactly, of so. our intestines. Exactly. So there's masses of area to absorb yes. the nutrients through. Good specimens of villi, would you say? Oh, excellent. I have to say, amongst the finest villi that I've ever seen. Oh, well. If you're concerned about your bowels, the first step is to go and see your GP. But you don't need an expensive camera to get an idea of what's going on inside your digestive system. You can tell a lot by just keeping an eye on what comes out the other end. We'll be showing you how later on.